slow cook tender pork steaks in a light creamy sauce with plenty of mushrooms. Now that's my kind of dinner. Hi, I'm Nikki. Welcome back to our kitchen where we show you how to make delicious family friendly recipes. Now, slow cookers don't have to just be used in the winter months. They're actually great for using in the warmer months as well because they don't heat up your kitchen. And you don't have to stick to casseroles. These lovely, juicy, thick pork steaks work really well in the slow cooker. So let's get cooking. We're gonna start by heating some oil. Heat two tablespoons of olive oil in a large frying pan over a high heat. Now I've got four thick boneless pork shoulder steaks here and we're going to season both sides using quarter of a teaspoon each of salt and black pepper. Place the steaks in the pan and fry for two minutes on each side until browned and then transfer to the slow cooker. Now add another tablespoon of olive oil to the frying pan and turn the heat down to medium. Add a large onion that's been peeled and thinly sliced and fry for about five minutes, stirring often until softened. Add three cloves of minced garlic and fry for a further minute while stirring. Now sprinkle two tablespoons of plain all-purpose flour over the onion and garlic and stir together to coat the onion. Now we're going to slowly pour in 360 ml, which is about one and a half cups of chicken stock. Pour it in slowly while stirring all the time. Now pour that liquid from the pan into the slow cooker. Now to the slow cooker, add 200 grams, which is about seven ounces, of sliced mushrooms, plus half a tablespoon of tomato puree or paste, half a tablespoon of white wine vinegar, and quarter of a teaspoon of black pepper. Stir it all together. Place the lid on the slow cooker and cook on high for three to four hours or low for five to six hours. Remove the lid and stir in 60 ml, which is about quarter of a cup of double or heavy cream, and then serve the pork steaks topped with a sprinkling of fresh parsley. I love to serve mine with creamy mashed potato and sprouts and covered in lots of that extra sauce. And they're my lovely slow cooked smothered pork steaks. I love to serve this up with either a jacket potato or some creamy mashed potato and some green veg. You'll find this recipe in my new book, It's All About Dinner. See you next time.